all your floor. I'm going to ask you a question, and boys, please be serious, brothers. Who knows or is on birth control? Yes. Who knows Stop someone or is on birth control? Today, I'm going to talk about, the, um, about birth control. Why it should be free and what it would be helpful to have it over the counter. First, we want to talk over the counter. Over the counter birth control can help with less teen pregnancies, and people would be probably often use it more and not because you won't have to go to the doctors to get it prescribed to you. And it could possibly be cheaper, but it could also be more expensive. The dangers of having over-the-counter birth control is not knowing you are pregnant and it can kill the fetus and kill your uterus completely. Not knowing underlying health conditions that the birth control kicks into the active gear and will harm you and end up in the hospital. And it would be probably taken for granted, like people who just want to, the girls, I just want to go out and have a fun time and not know, oh, I'm pregnant, this can just help, type thing. Um, summary of that, birth control, the over-counter could be beneficial for some people, especially those who have a low-income-based job, but it also could be taken very dangerously if not properly used. It could be also very expensive or very cheap due to Taxes are based off of like pregnancy tests and condoms and everything health-wise. Um, I'm also going to talk about free birth control. This birth control could be like taken, like you just go to the doctors and like get it, get it, and, like if needed type based. You get it out without insurance. And um, birth control also helps with the underlying health conditions, like seizures, like grandma absent seizures. They help regulate the hormones in a woman's body. A free birth control could also be taken for granted for people who just want to go and have fun type thing. But also the money has to come from somewhere to allow women to have this free birth control. So something has to go up so women can get it. Birth control can normally range from zero because of Planned Parenthood or the next plan bar ranges to a thousand dollars plus at times without insurance. Free birth control would allow women to get it without insurance and even with low income based and it could help with the underlying health conditions of a woman. I myself am on birth control. I have the next plan bar. I have pretty decent insurance through my mom's work, but it also costs my mom $50 to have mine placed into my body for my hormones. My big sister has it due to she has grand mal seizures and it helps with her hormones and helps her stay regulated and hormones actually cause more seizures than you would actually think. The next one bar is about an inch long, about the size of a matchbox, and then implanted for three, implanted one month and can take, be taken out three years later, which is why me and my sister have it and it takes so long. What is it, is it put into the muscle tissue? Is it? Yes. Okay, and so what does it do while it's in there? It slowly releases hormones and like the birth control medication, but it's like slower and you won't forget about it like a pill. Right. I can't use a patch because I'm allergic to adhesive and I had it one time and I broke out in the hives badly Got and it. almost ended up in the hospital. Okay. So the choices of birth control vary and it just, it's your preference. That's everything. Okay.